Hey everyone, thanks for joining the channel today. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through an example on how you can set up the tops list filter uh, so that you can follow stocks more precisely here on the Zero Pro trading platform. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring up our top, tops list here and we're looking at most active. So we can sort by last price, we can sort by net, net change, and let's say you only wanna watch stocks that are that have traded high that are trading higher than a dollar net change for the day so you can see here that there's a couple of symbols here that don't match that criteria so actually there's several stocks here that we can filter out and what we're going to do next is just go to our net change column right here on this row here just click the arrow go to custom and we're going to add one additional row here this one we're gonna say we want to see stocks that are traded greater than a dollar and this one we're gonna say that we want to see stocks that have dropped by 50 cents or more so for this field we're gonna type in a dollar and then here we're gonna type in negative make sure you uh, select the negative sign on your keyboard zero fifty cents okay and that's gonna create a filter based on these conditions. So let's go ahead and click OK. Now you can see the tops list updates here. So we're only seeing stocks now that have traded greater than a dollar on the day or less than 50 cents decline on the day. So we can do this on any of these filters. So we can go to NASDAQ, percent change up, and we can apply a filter, all right? and. The configurations that you make for each list is going to stay with that list. So if you go back to another list, whatever, however you built that uh, filter, whatever settings, the criteria that you have is going to stay with that list. So you can create several different uh, filters and have different conditions. So for example, this one we have on NASDAQ percent change up. We're looking at stocks that have traded greater than a dollar, but let's add one more condition. So what we're going to do now is uh, we're going to add one other condition here. We're going to go to volume and go to custom. And we're going to say we want to only look at stocks of traded greater. And then we type in 5 million here. 5 million shares on a day. So that's going to give us a really defined list here. Now if I bring this back down like this, I can focus on these stocks, these four stocks here. So we have a net change. All right, so we're looking at stocks that have traded greater than five million in, five million in shares, and also have, you know, that uh, that are trading higher than a dollar on the day. So again, it'll save with your layout. So once you got everything set up, you can save your layout, come back, and it's going to the software is going to uh, remember how you have this set up. So I hope that gets you one step closer and. Uh, being able to make smarter moves in the market. If you guys enjoy the content of this video, please click subscribe and also remember to visit us on social media. Thanks again for watching. I hope you have a great day.